What's going on guys? Good morning and welcome to another video. I hope you guys are doing great. I know I am. In this video, let's talk about something that is a favorite amongst many coin collectors and enthusiasts, which is a double die coin. Specifically, let's talk about the 1958 double die that just sold for $1.1 million. If you ever find one of these in your pocket change, you could be sitting on a fat stack of money. Uh, even if you find one that's a lesser double die than this one, you could be sitting on hundreds or even thousands of dollars. So let's check this coin out. Now, a lot of you might be thinking, I will never come across something like that. That's not so true with this one. This is a 1958 double die Lincoln cent, and it smashed all records for the sale of any double die sold at auction by exceeding a crazy amount of $1.1 million back in January, so only a couple months ago. The 1958 double die cent boasts very strong doubling with only three specimens this strong known, but you can find 1958 cents with doubling on them. Now, if you're lucky enough to find one that has this intensive doubling, which is easily recognizable to the naked eye, you could be sitting on thousands of dollars. This beautiful coin is comparable to the 1955 and 1972 double die cents that I've covered in other videos. This coin was sold by Great Collections in California, and the sale received over 100 bids and again sold for $1.13 million. This coin is known as the king of double dies. It is the finest of the three examples known, and in its first auction appearance, it sold for more than even one of the famous 1955 double dies. This variety was first reported in the early 80s and is mainly doubled in the inscription of In God We Trust and the word Liberty. This is also noted that it is from the Red Copper Collection of Lincoln Sense, which is an extremely famous collection. Lesser doubling can be seen on Lincoln's ear, his hair, his eyelid, his bow tie, and the folds of the vest. The 1958 double die was featured in the appendix of the Lincoln Scent double die, which is written by John Wexler in 1984, and is a last-minute addition since it had only been recognized a few years previous. Since that feature, the 1958 double die is a coin that many collectors want and many people search out for in their pocket change. Like I said, you may not come across an example of this 1958 Lincoln cent with such extreme doubling on it, but you can come across ones that have doubling that are still worth hundreds of dollars. So what a wonderful Lincoln cent variety to not only look for, but see sell for such a high amount at auction. Let me know what you think about this 1958 double die cent that smashed records and sold for $1.1 million. Let me know what you think about that in the comments below. And more importantly, let me know what you've come across in your coin and banknote searches in the comments. I'll see you there, and I'll see you in the next video.